And it's not easy to be able to supply every single day. Yeah. It's not easy. What, what do you need, mom, to be able to supply every day? Like, it, like as a farmer, what, 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 do, how, what do you have to have in place for you to be able to supply every day? Your field must be green. You must always have stock. Yeah. What exactly does it take for you as an emerging farmer to crack open the vegetable market in large grocery chain stores? To better understand this, I sat down, or rather, I toured the whole day with Jackie of JT Farms, you know, seeing her clients, even seeing her operations. We went to her farm to better understand this. And man, Jackie, she's got multiple operations. She even has got a, a chicken farm, which we also went to. And basically I toured with her, tagged along to better understand, you know, how she is making it so that we can assist, you know, you guys, right? People who are interested in entrepreneurship so that you can better understand. So wherever you are, you are in the world, wherever you are in Africa, the principles are the same, guys, when you're dealing with this type of market. So man, I'm going to be uploading many more videos, you know, uh, from my tour with Jackie because we covered many things, you know, poultry, we covered even the challenges of spinach farming itself and farming. So man, what you want to do, guys, you want to subscribe to this channel right now. Man, you also want to like, you also want to comment, you know, on this video right now. What do you think, you know, about what we're going to share? And also, what, what else do you want to see? Because this is Success Inspiration Academy. Our purpose on this channel is to inspire and empower entrepreneurs to reach the highest expression of their entrepreneurial gift and calling. So guys, let's get into the video. So how long have you been supplying this store? Probably six months. Yeah. Six months now? Yeah. Okay. So how often do they want this spinach? Thing? Every day. Every day? Every day. Sunday yeah. as well? Uh, Sundays I don't deliver. Sundays is my church day. Well, Saturday is your church day. Yes. But if they you could, they would want it. Yeah. <laughs> so what does the shop do on Sunday now? The shop opens. Normally they stock enough on Saturday to cover them for Sunday. Okay. Yeah. So so what what does it take to 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 supply like all this all the spinach for six months to a store? Yeah, it takes a lot. You you need to to have your stock every day because sometimes. If you don't have and you don't deliver to them, then they'll get it from someone else. So your, your, your garden or your field or your farm, it has to stay green all the time. You need to be very consistent in terms of supplying. Okay, 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 okay. So in terms of this store, because a lot of people want to know, right? A lot of people want to know, how do you get, uh, you know, actually into a store like this? Ah... Uh, I believe these people, they, these shops or chain shops or chain stores, somehow they need to give back to the community. Remember, it's the community that supports the shops and they give back by buying from local farmers. Mm. Uh, I don't think it's a smash train to be able to supply to, to them. Obviously, there were people who were supplying before I came into the system. And um, sometimes people run dry. Uh -huh. Sometimes they run dry, someone must step in. So as long as I can, I will, where I will fail and then they will, someone else can come through. But you, you just approach them, show them your product, uh -huh. and you show them your product. If they are happy, they try it in the shop. If customers respond, because what makes, you, what makes them come back to you is the response they get from the customers, or it's rather the volumes that they sell to customers. Okay. Yes. Right, so so uh, I think one thing that makes people fail is is consistency. Mm. Because if they want spinach every day, they, and it's not easy to be able to supply every single day. Yeah. It's not easy. What What do you need, mom, to be able to supply every day? Like, it, like as a farmer, what 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 do you, What do you have to have in place for you to be able to supply every day? Your field must be green. You must always have stock. Yeah. I mean, I know sometimes I run dry. If I run dry, rather you go to, to your friends who are also farming, you negotiate, you also offload them. 
yeah. the spinach, keep the customer with the stock that he wants. It's mm -hmm. not always that uh, you have uh, produce in your field. Like I think last week, as last week in some days we had a hailstorm. Mm. You don't tell the, the, the shop or the customer that I'm not bringing spinach because of the hail stop. Mm. Somewhere, somehow you must make a plan. Uh -huh. So go to other people who are, who are having the same product, get the stock, support them too, and keep your customer happy. Mm. 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 I know, I see, I see the customers are happy. <laughs> <laughs>